What's up everybody, Red Ring Roxas here. Today we are playing Pokemon Soul Silver. Now, I'm playing this game even though it's really old because I've never played it. So, I just wanted to play it and share my experience with YouTube. So, here we go. Now I've played uh, Silver on the Game Boy Color, so there is that. And I don't know if this is going to be the same or not, since it's a remake of Silver and Gold. So I guess we're going to find out. Alright, so here's my room. Got a Wii over here. Alright, go downstairs. And there's my mom. It's been a long time since I've played the Johto region though. And I can't remember if I beat it or not. So... This playthrough is going to be a pretty new experience for me, which I am really glad for. Because most of the games I've played, actually all the games I've played so far on my Let's Play channel, I've games I've played before. So, this is going to be pretty good, I hope. Alright then. I'm gonna go see Professor Elm next door. And there he is. Oh, cool. I already got our first Aaron of the game, that's great. <laughs> Alright, so let's see what Pokemon we've got. Cyndaquil, Totodile, or Chikorita. Hmm. Well, I always usually go with Fire type, because Fire types are my favorite. But Cyndaquil or Totodile looks pretty neat, so and I've heard that he learns Ice Punch. Which will be good for fighting grass types, so I'm gonna pick him. And Totodile has joined the party. Yeah! A nickname. Hmm. Nah. Alright, our first task. Ooh, got some potions. That'll be good. Won't have to run to the Pokemon Center so much.
Okay, he's sniffing me. Is there a guy up there? There's a guy up here. What are you doing? He punched me. What a jerk. What's this girl want? Ah, uh, where are you taking me? Poker gear. Hmm. I guess it's like the cell phone in silver and gold. Alright, let's go check this out. Alright, mom, give me my poke gear. Yeah, got a poke gear. Um, no. Now we can begin our journey. Gee, everybody's stopping me today. Oh, that's convenient. All right, that's cool. Ooh, first Pokemon battle. Here we go. I like how there's no Pokeball animation because he's he's already out of the Pokeball, so it's pretty cool. That might sound kind of dumb, but I think it's pretty neat how they made it where there's no Pokeball animation. Can you believe my Totodile is slower than this Pidgey? Or not. I might have to end up using one of those potions already. Ooh, a centric. I believe he's just a normal type Pokemon. He's like the equivalent of a Rattata from the first game. I've heard this game has both regions in it. Like you can go to Johto and Kanto, so that would be pretty neat to explore both regions. So I'm kind of looking forward to that. Ooh, level up. Yeah. I already learned Water Gun. Pretty sweet. I'll have a, um, a stab, di stab boost. The same type advantage boost. So that he does more damage with Water Gun. Which would be pretty nice. I think my game's lagging a little bit. That or I just can't walk. I am playing on an emulator for those of you who don't know, so my game is probably gonna lag. Because I don't know how to record on a real DS. Otherwise, I would do it. Well, I don't need any more water Pokemon. I've already got one. Thank you.
Oh, that's gross. Oh, he must have been joking. Oh, that's pretty neat. So you can, like, make it where they're always on, apparently. So. Oh, that's pretty cool. Yeah. I like that a lot better. And you can run inside. This is going to be a good playthrough. Alright, on to Mr. Pokemon's house. And we're getting stopped again. Of course we are. Ooh, map card. I guess now we have like the town map. Alright, so let's look at the town map. Okay, we were just in New Bark Town, Cherry Grove, and we're on our way to Mr. Pokemon's house, which is somewhere up here, I think. Alright, cool. Let's go ahead and get this journey underway. Yeah, that went a lot better. Let's see who lives here. Oh, I feel bad now because I didn't mean to visit him, but he thinks I did. Oh well. Now I can collect apricorn, so that's fine. Get a grin. I guess that's green. Green apricorn. Yeah. And I just turned nighttime. I'm gonna catch a pitchy probably. I've always liked Pidgey. When I played through the first region, I got a Pidgeot, and he was pretty much one of my go-to guys during the Elite Four. So I'm probably going to train a Pidgey during this playthrough, so I have a little something to like be familiar with. There's a lot of Pidgeys, holy crap. And I didn't mean to scratch, I was clicking the button too fast, that's great. really wish I had some Pokeballs. Hopefully I'll get some after this air and I run. That's okay. My Totodile is going to be too strong to weaken them by the time I get some Pokeballs. Jeez. I just want that Pokeball. Yeah, I'm really glad I picked Totodo. Since normally I am a fire type trainer, I'm kind of glad because it's a different ex Pokemon. Oh, he's happy. 
Oh, that'll be good if I get poisoned. Oh, they're blocking the way up there with their Pokemon battle. It's not bothered them. Ooh, a Weedle. Beedrills are pretty sweet, so maybe I'll come back here and catch one of those. I gotta think of who I'm gonna use in my team. Since I never played through the second generation all the way, I don't really know who's good and who's not. Oh, maybe this is his house. Aha! They got a mystery egg. I bet they have the Tokopi in it. Oh, he went Pokemon. That's pretty awesome. No, I don't have to worry about it. That's good. This is Professor Oak. What are you doing, Professor Oak? Ah, I got the Pokedex. Yeah. Golden Rod. I remember Golden Rod. Now I got his phone number. Yeah. Oh, I can go now. Cool. Not stuck in a cutscene forever. Oh, I got a phone call. Oh, I bet it was that redhead guy sitting outside. I bet he has something to do with why they're in trouble. Let me just not hurry over there and pick this acorn first. Sounds like a good idea. Ugh, freaking, as soon as I touch the grass, Pokemon battle. Oh, I thought he survived. Oh, right. Next level. And learned Rage. Rage is an alright move. If you know how to use it, I just kind of get rid of it. Even though it is pretty good. It, like, builds up power every time you attack. but Or every time you get hit. But that means you gotta sit there and get hit a bunch for it to be any good. So I'm not even gonna worry about it. I'm hoping to get back to the lab before I have to turn the recording off, but probably not going to make it. Yeah, I'm not going to make it. Don't these Pokemon know there's an emergency going on? Like, come on, guys. Oh, don't poison me. That would not be good. Ooh. Alright. Cool. Hopefully now I can make it back without any more distractions. Alright, well, I'm going to go ahead and cut the episode. Thank you guys for watching. If you guys enjoyed this, please give me some kind of input. 
I would greatly appreciate it. Hope you guys tune in for more Pokemon Adventure. And thanks again for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. I will see you guys next time. Roxas out.